Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram before we even get into the video. Anyways, as you guys know, you probably have seen the video already where I did my one year update. Now, I actually filmed this before I actually filmed that video. But anyways, I definitely want to share this with you guys. I am cutting my ends myself. I just decided to go ahead and do it myself. I already cut the back as you guys can see. I'm taking off about an inch to a half an inch because, yeah, I haven't, um... I have not, yeah, I haven't clipped my ends since I cut my hair a year ago. So, yeah, it's been a year since I completely cut all of my hair to, you know, grow it back even. So, this is basically how I'm clipping my ends. There's no special way that I'm doing this, honestly. I'm just pulling the hair down. Let me zoom in. I'm literally just pull, pulling the hair down, guys. And you hopefully you guys can see that, but where you guys see is thin at. I'm literally just gonna cut the straggly ends off or wherever it feels like straggly and like bunched up so like as you guys can see like look at these ends they look horrible they're all bunched up they're straggly they're matted on top of each other so yeah I'm just gonna clip them completely off I'm just using my cutting shears that I got from Sally's a long time ago and that's all I'm doing guys. I'm not a professional. I'm just doing it the easiest way I know how. Um, which is this way. You can cut yours off with like and twist if you want. But I find that I don't get really good results doing it that way. And my ends need to come off really, really bad. Because they're dead. Like. And then wherever I see some that's just straggly, I'm just cutting them off. And I had to cut the back off camera because obviously I wasn't gonna be able to like do it on camera and show you guys. So yeah, that's all I'm doing. I'm just looking at my mirror and I'm just taking the straggly ends off. I have different lengths of hair all over my head so it doesn't really even matter. Eventually I'll go maybe to a salon and let them cut it maybe in, or trim it in six months. Or shape it up but for right now I think this is good enough and then I just like to feel if it still feels like straggly I just cut more My hair is going to be all different lengths. It's always all different lengths. Always. So I don't even really too much care about that. So I don't really wear my hair blown out or anything. I just wanted to blow it out for my one year update and to clip my ends. And that's that. It's kind of hard doing this on camera. Oh, they feel a lot smoother. Feels a lot smoother and a whole lot better because that was a mess. So this is all of my dead ends. Oh, they feel so rough. This is how much I took off over my whole head. I don't know why I was so scared to cut it. Well, like do it myself and it actually turned out better than when I went to the salon before. Well, I'm not even going to get into that experience because if you watch that video, then you all know how I really felt about that. Yeah, this is my end clip. So I'm going to show you guys a before and after and how my ends look before I cut them. Oh, they look a lot better. Sheesh. Definitely can see a difference. I don't know if you guys can, but I can see a difference. So now all my twist outs and stuff will actually look nice and not straggly in a mess. My hair is a little bit like uneven on this side and it's always has been like that. So yeah, I'm just gonna let that do what it does. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful. I know it kind of went by fast, but yeah, I just wanted to get them off as you guys can see. 
So basically how you clip your ends, you'll just like, as you guys saw me doing it, if the ends feel straggly, like they're bunching up on each other and you have a lot of single strand knots, cut them off. You can, you will be able to see where they're straggly at. And then also if it's thinning out, like where, where the hair, when you pull the hair up and where, when it starts getting thin, that's where you cut as well. So that's basically what I did. So yeah, that is it. So I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful. Thanks for watching and I will see you all in my next one. Bye.